<laughs> Who knows what evil lurks in the heart of game? <laughs> the Shadow Snows. Hi, I'm the Shadow Snows and I'm back with another Vic 20 video. Tonight I'm going to play the game Another Vic in the Wall and you can already see in the demo that it's a breakout clone. Yeah, but the bat at least is fluent. Ball also fluent. Fire button doesn't do anything. Yeah, but it's a breakout game. Which is not really exciting. But then again, I think if if it's good or not, uh, de really depends on uh, how expensive this was. Of course, it, it is playable, but it's breakout. And yeah, it's, it is quite impressive how fluent uh, the bat and the ball are. Oh, and it, could, it doesn't slow down oh, when uh, when you lose a life. That's mean. Uh, and really, all, always only one break. Oh, that's that's bad. Come on. No, it really... Oh, and now it does. Great. That's really not good. Yeah, collision detection is... What was... Not, not good? What was the other word? Terrible. Terrible. And I wonder if it's done like that on purpose. I... I can imagine that. Otherwise, it's a really playable breakout game. But yeah, collision detection is really a little bit weird. Yeah, I really think collision detection is the biggest flaw of this really shit game. Otherwise, it's really quite good. I mean, good besides being breakout. Very close. Why isn't the collision detection better? Why? even some variation in the size and style of the brakes or fix which is always nice for the uh, unexpanded VIG-20 oh, come on 
Ew, crap. And that was stupid. Yeah, that was another wig in the wall on the unexpanded Commodore VIC-20. I hope you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching.